Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, I'm Val and today I'm going to take the topic being given to me which is the white color and the instant association that I have is white wolf but as far as I cannot make a Geralt at the moment I'm going to make city so if you're interested please keep on watching first step is as usual the foundation and I applied some Tata Shape Tape and L'Oreal foundation as usual I do the next step for me personally is the contour because I want her to be already contoured so I'm just taking some brown color and I'm placing it making my face a bit more elongated rather than mine I guess The next step will be to do the eyebrows and freckles. Uh, she has a pretty much straight eyebrows and I'm using the light brown pencil because uh, her brows are darker, much darker than her hair. So her hair is absolutely like gray white. Yeah, and I'm going to draw the eyebrows pretty much straight. Now I want to add some, a bit more dark color, but I need something grayish, so let me find one and I will be back. I'm going to take a bit of this gray black something, just a tiny bit, removing the axis and then going over. For the freckles, I'm going to use the cream paint in brown and this kind of sponge. This is a stippling sponge SFX thing, so basically all you need is just to take it a bit, put it into the paint and you can remove excess a bit and you can stipple up some pretty nice looking freckles. I'm taking it a bit to the forehead, generally around the face. After that, you can take the sponge that you used to apply the makeup and just press it gently. Don't swipe, don't do anything like that, just press gently. So you get both the blushing part and at the same time you get very nice freckles and on the photos that I usually post to my Instagram uh, you can take a look at that if you want to. Yeah. Um, the eyes left, let me bring you a bit closer and we will start with the eyes and then the scar. So basically her eye makeup is smoky eyes, <laughs> that is pretty smudged. I'm starting off with the brown color, I'm taking it on a semi fluffy brush and I'm going into the crease right here and elongating the eye a bit. Then more fluffy brush, just tiny bit of the same color, you can mix it a bit with the lighter one. And blend it out. Just to soften the look. After the first color basically blend out, you can take a darker brown, just gradually adding up and going lower. So this one will be darker brown. Let's go even darker with a brown, more of a packing brush, more dark brown.
this is what we got um, lashes maybe some gloss you can add gloss later if you want to um usually it destroys pretty much the makeup so i'm not going to do that right now but yeah let me finish with the lashes and i will be back for the scar part so now when the eyes are pretty much done and i'm going to cry soon until my lenses are like fixed in my eyes i'm going to start with the scar i still decided to keep you in this position because you can see it better uh but for the final look of course i will be bringing back everything yeah so her scar pretty much goes from here to here and this is like the very light outline that i want to have and i'm actually dabbing it down a bit oh my gosh that was unexpected so you see it leaves like a redness underneath this is by the way just an essence soft contouring and big proposal so yeah this is this is it and then i need a red with black body paint to fill up and then we will go with white and just a bit of shading yeah that's that's the plan very tiny brush To give it a bit of depth, I uh, need to take like a, not completely black, but something like that, and very tiny angled brush. So, so I'm just taking a bit of black from here, and um, trying not to overdo. Now the brown, uh, the same pretty much brown that I was using previously uh, for contour, the right one. I'm wiping up the brush, getting into the color, and I'm taking it a bit away from the color. And work, and it from the both sides and now back to red a bit redefining not too much but still and the white I feel like I want to add a darker red into here so I'm going to make some black with some red that's more like it yeah seems good let me review the things and apply the wig and we will see the final result so this is what I got at the end kind of not bad for the cosplay makeup if you're gonna get smudged during the day wearing the makeup it's gonna be just better yeah, I don't have like a proper grey wig, but I took the white one, so it kind of matches the white topic. White? Am I right? So, yep, this is the result. This is my version. Could be better, could be worse. I'm pretty pleased with this one. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments down below. And thank you so much for watching, thank you for subscribing to my channel. And I'm really glad to see you here on this channel. So, have a good day and bye.